Legacies is a very popular show, and they are always casting new people to feature on it. Most of the time, these roles that come out are for background characters or for very small roles. Just recently, the show has released multiple casting calls for different roles for a carnival scene. So, what is going on? Well, stay tuned because today, we're going to discuss Legacies casting for an upcoming episode. Be featured on the show this way. The product description for the scene. One thing to cover before we really get into this video is what the scene is actually about. We know it's a carnival scene, but what does the official description tell us about it? According to Backstage.com, where all this information comes from the scene is casting a carnival scene for the CWTV series Legacies, starring Daniel Rose Russell and Matt Davis. Project description, Hope Mickelson, the tribrid character of a vampire werewolf hybrid, makes her way in the world. The TV show is a spinoff of The Originals and The Vampire Diaries. We also gather from this that everything is being produced by the CW as the show is released by them. The website states, the CW Network, CBS Television Studios, Warner Brothers Television, casting all talent, Julie Pleck, executive producer, Dashia brooke Wathen, casting director. Now you know that this production is no joke. Get ready for the roles. First up is Featured Extra. The first casting listing on this list is for a featured extra. Would you like to be a random extra on the show and feature in a scene? Well, well, this is the one for you. This means that the person cast in the role will feature on the show and on screen. Most extras are just background characters, but because this is a featured role, the extra will be on screen in the forefront in some form. The casting call states pays $125 an hour. Casting director states seeking various acts with an overall darker grunge vibe. Think Jim Rose Circus Show, but all types are welcome to apply. Ethnicity, all ethnicity. In terms of being the right person for the role, this actually doesn't seem that bad. Most people would fit the specificity. Next, guests and employees. This next one is really open to interpretation. Do you want to be a guest on screen? You could basically be anyone and get yourself on the show if they take you on. The casting call states pays $88 for 8 hours. Shooting December 9th to 10th and 13th to 14th. Ethnicity, Asian, Black, African descent, ethnically ambiguous, multiracial, indigenous peoples, Latino, Hispanic, Middle Eastern, South Asian, Indian, Southeast Asian, Pacific Islander. The pay on this one is really great and you could be anyone and get this role. If you really want to be a part of this creation of legacies, this one might be great for you to go for. And now, bus stop patrons. Here's another way to have an easy chance of getting onto legacies in some shape or form. Do you want to be a bus patron? This one is pretty specific, as you'll be a bus patron if you get this role. The call states pays $88 for 8 hours, shooting December 13th to 14th. Ethnicity, Asian, Black African descent, ethnically ambiguous, multiracial, indigenous peoples, Latino, Hispanic, Middle Eastern, South Asian, Indian, Southeast Asian, Pacific Islander. These past two seem to pay the same, which shows how small the role really is. However, if you want to get on the show, it's going to be a great one to get. Now, a juggler. Would you want to get on the show as a juggler? Well, this role is going to be really interesting if you want to go for it. The call states, pays $250 for 8 hours. Casting director states, seeking various acts with an overall darker grunge vibe. Think Jim Rose Circus Sideshow, but all types are welcome to apply. Most of the performers will need to be walking around and moving around with the crowd. If your act requires you to be stationary and set up in a certain area, please let us know. Ethnicity, Asian, Black African descent, ethnically ambiguous, multiracial, indigenous peoples, Latino slash Hispanic, Middle Eastern, South Asian, Indian, Southeast Asian, Pacific Islander. The juggler role is much more interesting than the other ones so far, but you need some experience to get this role. You probably won't be on the show for too long, but at least you get your name out there if you're into that sort of thing. Next up, stilt walkers. Here is another really cool role for this amazing circus scene. Do you want to show off your skills as a stilt walker on screen in a very popular show? Well, if so, this one's for you. This one also pays much more than the other roles because of the skill set it requires. The casting call release states pay pays $500 for 8 hours. Casting director states, seeking various acts with an overall darker grunge vibe. Think Jim Rose Circus Sideshow, but all types are welcome to apply. Most of the performers will need to be walking around and moving around with the crowd. If your act requires you to be stationary and set up in a certain area, please let us know. Ethnicity, Asian, Black African descent, ethnically ambiguous, multiracial, indigenous peoples, Latino, Hispanic, Middle Eastern, South Asian, Indian, Southeast Asian, Pacific Islander. Another really interesting role for a really cool scene. What about fire performers? Fire performer is going to require a very specific skill set and the payment reflects this. You're going to get a lot of money for being on screen and not messing up your fire performance. You will also get on the show in a really cool and interesting way. The call states, stunt contract pays $1,056 for 8 hours. Casting director states, seeking various acts with an overall darker grunge vibe. Think Jim Rose Circus Sideshow, but all types are welcome to apply. Most of the performers will need to be walking around and moving around with the crowd. If your act requires you to be stationary and set up in a certain area, please let us know. Ethnicity, Asian, Black African descent, ethnically ambiguous multiracial, indigenous people, Latino, Hispanic, Middle Eastern, South Asian, Indian, Southeast Asian, Pacific Islander. It's so nice they don't care about gender or ethnicity for these ones. It really means that anyone could apply for the role. And now what else is there about these roles? Another thing to cover about this production is the rules and compensation around it. In this new COVID era, actors and actresses are required to have a COVID-19 test one to two days prior to shooting. The shooting also takes place on December the 9th to December the 13th this year. It looks like if you get a role, you won't have long to sort out your plans around getting to the set. We also know that the pay varies per role, which you had seen throughout the 
this video thus far. If you want to hear anything else regarding these roles, head over to Backstage.com, where all the information will be placed. You can also apply for these roles and hear more about them if you have an account on the website. And finally, getting the roles. Now that we have been through all the roles of the website for the specific scene in an upcoming episode of CW's Legacies, what do we know about getting the roles? Of course, you will need the skill and qualifications depending on the role to possibly get it. The harder ones to get are the carnival ones like the fire performer and the stilt walker. Those are definitely for very specific people who are trained in the art of those things. Some of the others, however, are basically for anyone that will show up to them. None of the others really require anything, so it's cool to see a role be so available. Also, the vast majority of these roles really don't care about ethnicity or gender, so anyone can possibly get a role here. And that's the end of the video. Legacies is going to have an amazing episode with this carnival scene, whilst we get lots of information about what roles will be needed for the production side of things. It also gives some sort of hints towards fans of the show. We know that a scene like this is on the horizon and will probably be on our screens in the upcoming months. The turnaround on these projects isn't actually that long, so we should see this sooner rather than later. If you get into the production from this video, you should let us know in the comments below. It's a really cool opportunity to be on such a well-loved show and in such interesting roles. The carnival-specific roles are really cool and should bring something really interesting to the scene when they finally release this in a few months. Let us know what happens with these roles down below. Hopefully you enjoyed this latest video. If you did, would you please let us know down in the comment section below? It would be very helpful. Make sure to like this video, comment down below, and of course subscribe to the channel with the notification bell rung. Thank you for watching today's video. Bye!